Hey everyone, in this quick video I will show you how to fix the Valorant Unreal CEF subprocess.exe which is causing a high CPU usage. So please follow the steps with me and let's get started. Okay, so the first solution to fix this issue is to add exceptions in your antivirus. So open up your antivirus, in my case it's Avast. If you have AVG or any other antivirus, then you need to follow the same process. So what we need to do, just click on menu and then after that, select settings. Then click on exceptions. Over here, we need to add exceptions for Riot Games. So to do that, just click on add exceptions. Then click on browse and expand local C drive. Look for Riot Games folder and expand it. And the next one is Valorant. After that, live. Then engine folder next binaries and the last one is win64 and now scroll down to the bottom of the page look for unreal cef subprocess.exe make sure to check this one and after that click on ok then select add exceptions once you're done then close your antivirus and restart your computer so after you restarted your device and if the first solution didn't work then you can try the next method. So open up your search bar and type in there Windows Defender Firewall and open it up. Then on the top select allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. In here click on change settings and next select allow another app. So now we need to add Riot Vanguard, Riot Game and Valorant file to the firewall allowed exceptional list. So to do that, just click on Browse and on the left select Local Disk C Drive. Then look for Riot Games folder and open it up. Next, Riot Client. Over here, select Riot Client Services and click on Open. Then click on Add. Once you add it, make sure both private and public is checked. After this, we need to add Valorant, so we need to follow the same process. Just click on allow another app, browse again, local disk, and write games folder. Over here, select Valorant folder, then live, and select Valorant, and click on open. Click on add. So as you can see, Bootstrap Pack God game is added, so now we need to make sure both is checked, private and public. Next, we need to add Valorant Win64. So just click on Allow Another App, Browse, Shooter Game, Binaries, Win64, and over here, select Valorant Win64 and click on Open. Then click on Add. So again, make sure both options are checked. And the last one that we need to add is Ride Vanguard. So follow the same process, click on allow an hour app, then browse, select local disk C, then program files, and in here look for Riot Vanguard folder. Open it up and select vgc.exe and click on open. And then click on add. Okay, after add it to the list, then I will make sure both public and private is checked. Once you finished in here, then click OK and launch your Valorant. Hopefully this should fix the issue. And that's all. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider supporting me and subscribing for more videos. Thanks for watching.